Hello Darts Nuts, welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm having a look at another set of the Loxley Flip Grip Darts and these are the Gisborne. Now the Flip Grip Darts allow you to uh, swap either end of the dart. It's a soft tip dart but I'm going to be using steel tip conversion points so you can use it for soft or steel tip. So let's check them out. So they are sold as soft tips but obviously you can use them for steel as well and they're only 18 grams and they're 90% tungsten and retail for £38.95. So the darts come in a slimline cardboard packaging got some nice picture of the countryside I don't know where that is like. Um, inside you got a plastic inlay with a velvety covering and the darts fitted into a nice green point holder did you know green's my favorite color <laughs> anyway they fit with the Loxley medium nylon stems and they come supplied with the Loxley standard shape flights with the feather effect now also they've got the soft tips fitted but I'll probably use some steel tip conversion points when I come to throw them Just for the sake of showing you, I fitted them with the, I think these are the Cosmo Fit Metal steel tip conversion points. So actually looks quite neat against the barrel on that one. Now the idea with the flip grip is you can just reverse the barrel, but with this particular dart, it's quite a simple design. So there's just a very fine, thin ring and groove section there. And on the rear it's just the same again but now you've got some wider deeper grooves so you get a little bit more grip on that one than you do on that one so if you to flip it around that's what it'll basically basically look like when it's reversed so not a huge change of course but the idea behind these is it's meant to be balanced no matter which way you flip it around but Obviously you get a little bit of different grip depending on what you like. So they fit with the Loxley nylon stems and supplied with the standard shape feather effect flights. All right then, so you got a, a kind of a tapered end both sides, but that one is just very thin grooves, flat rings. And then after that, it's mostly smooth, but kind of got a, a taper either side and then on the very end or the front if you're flipping it over the ring and grooves just deeper grooves and wider spaced rings so that's basically it so there you go that's the super close look at the Loxley Gisborne darts The darts come fitted with 25mm soft tips, the front of the barrel is a smooth tapered section that's 6.3mm, then you've got some fine rings and groove that's 4.5mm, middle section it's kind of tapered both ends that's 16.4mm and that's all smooth and then on the rear you've got a ring grip with deeper grooves that's 5.8mm then a smooth taper on the very end 5mm length 38mm widest 7.2mm Seventeen point nine six grams, eighteen grams exactly, and seventeen point nine six. So, with the setup with stems, flights, and soft tips, it would be twenty point two seven grams. I'll take that soft tip away. I'll just add the Cosmo Fit Metal metal Conversion Points that would be 21.85 grams. This is the balance with just the soft tips attached and with the supplied set up and this is the balance with medium in between short nylon stems and standard flights.
it's pretty low level grip overall just that small section which is around about four I don't know what happened to that last one. Then first two flew quite nice actually. It's only a short dart so the balance is quite nice. Probably going to be best around the middle because it's kind of like that shape. Um, can't tell whether that rear section is a slightly longer tape but it's hard to tell. But there's not a massive difference between the two different grips. The one that I'm holding here it's kind of just like a thin uh, groove etched into a smooth dart so fairly low level grip there and on the rear part obviously you can flip it around to put that to the front if you want but it's just a, a deeper groove so just a little bit more grip there but just a nice balanced dart a little bit on the light side but uh, nice and easy to release because there's not a great deal of grip there but I suspect it's probably going to be uh, best balanced around the middle so I'll give that a try now. Well it's definitely nicely balanced around that middle section or like I've said before with the flip grip series, mid grippers are kind and losing out on the feature of the dart, which is having two different grips either side. But um, I suppose if you're a mid gripper and you don't need a lot of grip and you like a nice short dart, it's still quite a nice one. But you're just not getting the, the main feature, I suppose. Well, that bothers you. <laughs> but like I say, it is nicely balanced there. So there you go. So like I said, there's not a massive difference between the two halves. So the one that I'm holding now just very slightly more grippy simply because the grooves are a little bit deeper Ooh, got a treble so I guess with this particular one in the flip grip series it's just a case of people who like a low level grip and if you like a really low level grip then one half is a little bit less grip than the other but if you're in the middle, you don't really have any choice. <laughs> well, it was quite nicely balanced around the middle. So there you go. There's not, like I say, a massive difference, but a nice little short dart. So for mid grippers, certainly get the best of the balance. And whether you're a front or a rear grip, it, it just depends on how low of a grip you need. If you need it really low, then you'll probably want that part and just a little bit more on the other side. Ah, two in the treble. I thought that was 
second one was going in but it kind of like tipped over <laughs> but quite a nice balance to it because it's only a short dart but like I say there's not a lot of grip so it's one of them that is probably just for people who don't like a lot of grip and like I said with the all flip grip series mid grippers kind of like lose out on the feature but there might be still something there if you just like a short dart and you're happy hold on in a smooth part really nicely balanced there so there you go that's the Loxley was it Gisborne I do like the names that they pick for the darts it's all to do with the uh, Nottingham and Robin Hood theme Loxley Forest Sherwood everything like that uh, so I'll leave you with the gallery so you can have a close look at them if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet please do so and I'll see you in the next one happy darting